Hello everybody, this is Dad the E-Vegan. Welcome back. So today I thought I'd do a video on our two year anniversary of going vegan. So um, July 4th weekend was basically our two year anniversary of going vegan. And you know, so I just thought I'd do a video about it, just kind of, you know, talking about our some of our experiences and some of the impact that we've made. So, you know, outside of the health benefits that we've experienced from going vegan, I know for me personally, um, I was having, I was starting to have some blood pressure issues prior, prior to going vegan. And, and of course, uh, prior to going vegan, I was consuming a lot of animal products in the sense that um, I would consume a lot of eggs, uh, chicken, um, some meats. Didn't, didn't really uh, do beef a whole lot because, you know, I thought that beef was terrible and, uh, and you know, chicken and eggs were great. <laughs> Um, so, but I was still consuming a good amount of animal products on a daily basis. But I, I, I was noticing that I was starting to have some blood pressure issues. My blood pressure was creeping up a little bit. Um, and I would say about within a month, maybe three weeks of going vegan, um, um, my, I would say about a month, my blood pressure dropped significantly um, to where now my, my blood pressure is always normal and normal meaning systolic under 120 and diastolic under 80. There are times when I've been at work um, and you know I've been moving around uh, walking because I you know walking fast I, no I normally walk fast when I'm at work um, and you're normally supposed to when you check your blood pressure you're normally supposed to be in a rested position so you're supposed to check your rest and blood pressure and so you're supposed to be seated for about five minutes before you before you check the blood pressure so you can check your true resting blood pressure. And there are times when I will be, again, just, you know, at work, just walking, um, not seated for five, that, you know, that five minute time frame. And I just go on the blood pressure machine to check my blood pressure. And it is, you know, un, it is normal. It's under 120 and under 80. And you know, it makes me really feel good. It really does because prior to going vegan, I I almost felt a little hopeless in the sense that I felt like I wasn't able to control my own health, thinking that it was um, it was just something that that just was gonna happen. I was just bound to have high blood pressure, or you know, I may just be bound to have some of these problems that that I know that other people have. Um, including my parents, both of my parents, um, and and my siblings as well. Um, so you know, I, I I was thinking that you know, I was going to be helpless, but to to feel like to feel that you have control over your own health is an amazing feeling. It's a it's an amazing feeling, and it's really it's really touching at the same time. It's really touching because. I mean, there's nothing more powerful than feeling like you're in control or feeling that you're in control over your own um, kind of destiny, uh, is the, for lack of a better term, your own destiny or your own, um, you know, what's um, just, what, just what's gonna happen to you and, and just feeling that you're in control over, over your future. And, and um, I mean, who, who wants to grow up taking medications every day for blood pressure diabetes cholesterol things like that um, the other thing my cholesterol dropped significantly so um, another thing like my cholesterol was on uh, borderline high it was pretty much high because your um, uh, total cholesterol is supposed to be under 200 and my cholesterol the last time that it was the, the highest time the highest point before I went vegan was uh, I would say about maybe 205 or something like that. Um, now my my cholesterol, my total cholesterol is under 150. Okay, and uh, I believe it's around like 130, 140, but it's well under 150. 
and um, and in this in the research and scientific community, uh, in order to prevent, in order to be heart attack uh, proof, um, it's uh, it is good to have cholesterol total cholesterol level of under one fifty to be a heart attack proof. So um, that is. Again, that's another amazing thing. That's another amazing benefit of going vegan. Um, my A1C, which is a measure of my sugar level over you know past couple of months, which is again a measure of a, it's a more comprehensive measure of what your sugar level is instead of checking like you know a fasting or a random. Uh, my A1C dropped. Um, is my A1C it dropped? You know that's amazing because my A1C was not I was not borderline before I was not borderline uh, diabetic or high or anything like that it was bored it was um it was normal okay again I was not borderline I was not high it was normal and even that number dropped which is amazing it's it's amazing it really shows it, it really proves the uh, the information that I've been learning, um, uh, it really confirms the the information and, and and further proves the information that I've been learning over this two year period of doing my research on um, on on plant based nutrition. That the the main cause of diabetes, the main cause of diabetes, is the high consumption of fat, specifically high consumption of saturated fats, saturated fats. So again, for me, the, the main benefits, going vegan, um, blood pressure, uh, blood pressure benefits, cholesterol benefits. And again, I didn't have, I didn't have any uh, uh, blood sugar problems, but that was also benefiting that. Um, you know, I noticed certain Rashes that I that I used to have was gone. I noticed certain, you know, I don't know if that was as a result of me going vegan or if that's just, you know, if if that was um, if that was a, you know, a, a correlation or something like that, coincidence, whatever. I don't know, but that also happened. You know, my my wife has also, you know, she can attest to the benefits that she's experienced as well. Um, you know, my energy level is my energy level is high. You know, I feel I feel great. Um, not a not I don't get aches and joint pains and things like that. Um, I mean, sometimes you know you get the you, you, the usual you know pain from you know maybe not sleeping well or I mean I you know for my I have a second job. <laughs> for my second job, I wake up at three in the morning. And, and that feels painful so you know just just your typical um day-to-day -day kind of thing but other than that any there's no there's nothing chronic there's no chronic pains or anything like that so i've i've experienced a lot of benefits i've experienced a lot of health benefits from going vegan and again my wife can attest the same and this is this is typical of most people that go vegan and i want to put an emphasis on whole food plant-based low fat um vegan diet that's what i want to put an emphasis on because a lot of things are vegan coca-cola is vegan um oreos are vegan um i believe skittles are vegan um those are not health foods those are junk foods so you know want to put a big emphasis on whole foods plant-based low fat vegan diet so that is the best um that is the that is the best that has the most research most research um, to be the most healthy diet the most healthy diet um, so I want to put an emphasis that on on that this is that the e vegan I'll be putting out more videos and content so please like subscribe and share for more updates continue evolving peace also Use my referral code in the description below to get 1,000 miles of free supercharging with the purchase of a new Tesla.